Alright, hello, welcome to your second expression tutorial. This one is going to be a little bit more complicated. Okay, so there's another statement called print. And what you do is you type print, and then a opening um, parenthesis, and then you can type whatever you want in here inside of quotes. So I do quote, hello world. And I know I broke the robot doing the hello world tutorial first last time. Also, if you, now you have to look at the console, it says hello world. Actually, I'm going to clear this, so it's because we're going to be using the console a little bit more now. So if you do this, it says hello world. Um, I know I broke the rule last time about doing a hello world first, but honestly, hello world is not at all a useful example for Gary's mod. So we're not going to do that. Okay, this time we're going to get rid of the text output, and we're just going to do if button equals equals one. What this is, is it's called an if statement, which essentially it, it just checks things. Uh, in this case, what we have to check are variables against other values. So if you have, so this says if the value in button equals one, equals one, then do whatever is in here. So for example, if we put print hello world like that, whoops. Also, you're not supposed to have a space between the name and the semi or, and the parentheses. Okay, so for some reason I get rid of the button, but put that back. Get this out, just wire button to this, and then when you press this button, you'll notice it said hello world again. You can press it again, it'll say hello world. It says hello world every time you press it. Because whenever the button's value equals one, then it will be then it will be, be like, oh okay, now the now button equals one, and we should say hello world. Um that's pretty much what I'm using the print statement for. I'm not gonna use it for anything like I mean, another thing that what you can usually use it for is like variables. Like, if you want to check what something is at some point, or check if the program is even reaching a given point, you can d use it there. Um, but not right now. Okay, so that's gonna be it for this tutorial. So thanks for watching and goodbye.